What's up, ass babes? I just got home from school. How you doing? Um, I ordered Little Caesars, right? Because that's how I was feeling. That's my business. And I waited and waited and waited. I waited over 30 minutes because they got to make the deep dish fresh. You don't have these. And then I was doing stuff on my phone. I did not feel like getting out of my car. That's why I went through the drive-thru. I hear somebody vacuuming. It would be nice if they vacuum my room. That ain't gonna happen. I was at work. I was like, oh my God. Please tell me that somebody took out the trash. Because honey, you have that trash sitting for a whole nother week. Mm. Terrible. I was late this morning. Y'all like, right. Cindy was home all day. And she didn't take out that trash. We're gonna have a problem. I got home. I was afraid to come in the house. If I walk in and that kitchen is a disaster the way it was when I left this morning, my attitude is gonna be on a building. It is gonna be like the exorcist up in hell. But it's better than it was this morning. So I ain't complaining, it's much better. And she ran the dishwasher. Mm -hmm. She ran the dishwasher. Hey, Bobby. Hey, girl. Mm. She's showing y'all her inches. Oh, I got my scarf on, sorry. How was your body took SAT today? How was it? I did take the SAT today. How was it, and Bobby? It was a lot easier for me. Um, this go around than the first time. I don't know why. I was looking up more strategies yesterday. Oh. And I found this one and it worked for me. What, what strategy was that? Well, so I always had a hard time finding out like the best way to like tackle the reading section because it's like my weakest it brings down my score a lot <clears throat> and so i'd be like i don't know if i should read the questions first and then read the story like don't read the story just answer the questions try to find it it did not work for me i barely i got like halfway through and the lady was like 10 minutes left and i saw like 20 questions left so safe to say that does not work for me so basically this go around I just read the I read the passage really fast like I didn't read it for understanding but I just read it to where like I knew what was going on to the slightest and so I wasn't like really really reading like deep into it because there's no time for that no you ain't got time for that you don't got time for that so you skimmed it I just skimmed the entire passage just reading it really fast fast as I could and then I'm gonna go to the questions and then I would kind of know what was going on and I was able to answer the questions pretty quickly. And it's the first time PSAT or SAT where I was ever able to finish mm. the reading section. Usually I'm not able to finish them, but I was able to finish it this time. And I had like a minute left, two minutes left. So usually I just have to bubble in those last 10 questions, but I finished this this time. I finished you this feel time. confident with your answer choices. Yeah, yeah. I felt, I felt... I feel as though I did better on this one than I did on my first one. Mm -hmm. We don't got to talk about what I got on the first one, but all that matters is that I think I did better on this one. I know I did better. We're manifesting it right now. Manifesting that. Mm. Mm. I learned a new mm. dance. I learned two new dances today. Oh, but she doesn't like to show me the dance. We have to redo our TikTok dance because it was a little rough and now that my hair's done, my hair's done. So we can be cute now. So we cute too? Yeah, we cute. So we cute. Well, that's good to hear. Uh, you have to pay for your basketball. How it's much? due today. What are you talking about? That's what Coach Cap said. I don't even know if I'm gonna if I'm gonna be able to play. Well, he's asking for money. How much? Fifty bones. 
50. And off camera conversation. Um, so I have to submit college applications at the end of the month. And so it's kind of. It's gonna be a little. It's gonna be a little, little, little check. You know what I'm saying? It's gonna be a little check. But I'm just saying. I'm letting you know now. I'm letting you know now. Anyways. I'm working on my college applications. I haven't worked on them in a minute, actually. I mean, not since this weekend. So what schools are you applying to? No. <laughs> um, so the schools that I'm applying for right now, right now, I'm applying for- Are these reach schools or? I have like a mix, kind of like a mix. Let me go get my phone so I'll be able to tell you because I'm not gonna remember. Okay, what you got? Okay, so these are the schools I'm applying to right now. I don't know if it's gonna be all of them, but I don't know. I feel like I don't know. We gotta visit Cali, so <laughs> anyways, ciao. So the schools that I'm applying to right now are Baylor, Howard, NYU, U of H, University of Virginia. University of San Diego, UCLA, Berkeley, San Diego, UC San Diego, UC Santa Barbara, maybe UC Austin, maybe. They both really want me, her and Sydney, both really want me to apply there, but. I don't know. I mean, I guess, I guess I will. And then San Diego State. Just Are those all reach schools? I don't know. No, okay, so my reach schools are probably University of Virginia, Berkeley, UCLA. Okay, and why did you pick these schools? Honestly, I don't know. I don't know. I kind of just, I looked at some of the campuses. All the San Diego schools are so pretty. I was looking at that. All the San Diego schools are so pretty. And they're all like bigger colleges. And I'm going to go to a big college. So. What if you get a small, uh, get a scholarship for a big college? I mean, for a small college. What if you get a scholarship for a small college? A full scholarship. What do you mean a full scholarship? To go to a small college. To play ball. Oh, to play basketball? Oh, I don't know. I think it, I don't know. Both my basketball coaches right now at school, they've been like talking to a lot of college coaches. But it's just like, I don't really know, cause I I don't really want to go to a small school. Like I'm grateful for them trying, but I I'm definitely keeping my options open, cause if that's an option, then it's free. And are, do you know what you want to major in yet? That's why I can't finish my college applications, cause I don't know what I want to major in. Cause I have to declare a major that I'm applying into. For you can't every do school. you can't do liberal arts. Then you can change later because you still got to start with your basics. I don't know. I think I could just pick undecided. That's liberal arts. But I don't. I don't really know. Well, um, liberal arts you do a little bit of everything. Your English, your history, your science. You do a lot of those. That will transfer into your major. Cause you gotta get your basics. I started with liberal arts, but that kind of worked out. Cause mm -hmm. you wanted to be a teacher. Cause you went into teaching education, mm -hmm. even law. Um, business is like the thing I was gonna go into, but business is the most competitive major to get into. So I don't know. And then law. I haven't done anything in law. Oh my god. <laughs> Oh my god. Need to blow your nose? Ooh. Mm -mm. I haven't done anything law related in school at all. And I just don't know if it would be something because I don't want to start the major and then not like it. Well, you like debate. We had this discussion with debate.
Um, we're gonna see, but so far I have a lot of schools down that I'm applying for. It's just college applications are so expensive, it's so dumb how expensive they are. Just to apply to a school. And if you don't get in, then you don't get your money back. Oh my god, in my SAT this morning, I drank so much water and a whole energy drink before. And the lady didn't give us a chance to go to the bathroom, so I had to go through that whole 65 minute reading section without using the bathroom. And I had to pee so bad. So bad, it was unreal. I was like, ooh. So why you didn't go before you went into the room? I don't think about it. Usually, we start and then we sit there for like 30 minutes. So I was like, I'll just go in, check in. So I'll run through some stuff and then let's go because that's how it worked my last SAT. Not this time. Not this time. My kid. Give this video a thumbs up or not. Until next time.